Well, the main Premier League talking point at the moment is surrounding the future of the Chelsea manager, Maurizio Sarri. Myself, Warren Ashurst and Tom McGarry alongside to discuss what might go on at Stamford Bridge in terms of Sarri's future. Firstly, Tom, it's hardly ideal preparation for Chelsea going into the Europa League final with Arsenal next week. No, when you're going into a big final like that with so much at stake, you want to be talking about matters on the pitch, who you're going to select in your starting lineup, and how you're going to set up. But... This is nothing new for Sarri. It feels like throughout the season there's been pressure on him, speculation regarding his future. He's always been just one defeat, say, away from the sack. So we'll be used to that from, from that point of view, but he must be getting frustrated and certainly fed up with the constant speculation. Yeah, I would, I would assume that is the case. He's already said that he plans to speak to the Chelsea owners after the Europa League finally he wants to focus on the game in Baku first because that is the most important thing, of course, at the moment. But as you say, it has been going on all season. And in fairness to Sarri, you have to say he's got them in the Champions League for next season. He's got them to a European final. He was very close to winning the League Cup final as well. So could he have done much more with the squad that he's got? I don't think he could have done that, particularly when you consider how good Liverpool and Manchester City have been domestically this season. I think if you had offered a lot of Chelsea supporters at the start of the season two cup finals and a third place finish, they probably would have taken that. So it's more to do with the style of football and some of the decisions he makes. But I think he's done more than enough to justify another season in charge. If Sarri is to go, of course, then it leads to another massive summer in terms of who's going to come in and replace him. And we've had all sorts of reports recently about potential targets for Chelsea. But they're going to, first and foremost, the new man, Tom, work with the prospect of not having anybody to come in and maybe losing the best player in Eden Hazard. Yeah, it's going to be very difficult circumstances if someone new does come in. And that might limit Chelsea in terms of who they could possibly turn to. I know Max Allegri, who's leaving Juventus, has been one name linked with the job. But I'm not sure if he'll be particularly interested in going into that kind of project it's not the most attractive at the moment and they may have to limit or, or look elsewhere in terms of the managers they're going to bring in it might be someone from a lesser position or, or someone lacking in experience well talking about lacking in experience Frank Lampard and John Terry two Chelsea legends have been mentioned as possible contenders to take over too early for both of those do you think I think it probably would be certainly in the case of Terry who's got no managerial experience Frank Lampard's been cutting his teeth in the championship with Derby and could potentially take them to the Premier League if they win the playoff final so if he's able to do that he might not actually be interested in moving to Chelsea he might fancy a crack with Derby in the Premier League so Difficult one for Chelsea. I think that kind of appointment would certainly appease the fans and they would get plenty of time to, to try and stamp their authority on things. But I think that would be too big a job for, for those two people at the stage of their managerial careers. Finally for you, does he stay or does he go? I think he deserves to stay, like the first and foremost. I think he's done more than enough in showing his qualities as a manager, adapting to a new league, a new language and things like that. Ultimately, though, we know Chelsea can be pretty trigger-happy when it comes to managers, and I am worried that he may be out of a job uh, come the end of, uh, or come the next couple of weeks. I have to say, I'm with Tom on this. I think he should stay and build on what he's already created over the last season or so, even if they don't win the Europa League. I still think they've got Champions League football to uh, look ahead to, but... Also, I do think he might well be on the move. I think Chelsea might feel that the time is right to make another change. That's what we think. What about you? Will Maurizio Sarri be leaving Chelsea after the Europa League final?